Hello and welcome back to XCOM Chimera Squad with me, DX Phoenix. Hope everyone enjoyed the last episode and we're going to get right into this one. As I said before, this is a blind playthrough. I've literally not long got finished uh, recording the first episode, so I'm recording this one directly after. So any comments from the previous one I've not seen yet. Um, but as soon as I have, if you've got any feedback, I will try and get right into that but right now we have got the situation which is in the memorial museum aftermath so it's a critical mission we are going to have a look memorial museum aftermath 31 pd needs help pulling through the aftermath of tonight's attack death has, mayor nightingale's death has the city on edge let's do what we can to help Gonna send in APC, sending APC to resolve the situation will automatically advance the day. Are you sure you are ready to proceed? Yes. There's nothing else I can do at the moment. Mm -hmm. I am gone. I do apologize for that. Not. I've done what we've done what we can to aid 31 PD. Commissioner Maluf passed along her thanks for helping her officers bear the weight of this attack. Thank Your you. work with 3-1 PD opened a few doors. Here's what we know. A crude plasma bomb killed the mayor. The insurgents had no access to materials for that. Does that mean they had outside help? Most likely. There are three groups in City 31 with access to this kind of ordinance. Hmm. Only three. Right. Choose a faction to be the investigation target. The target faction cannot be changed until it's resolved. Okay. So let's look at these. We have the Prodigy. No, we don't. We have Progeny. We have the Prodigy. We have the Grey Phoenix. I am sorry about that. Let me just mute that. So we have Grey Phoenix. And we have... I can't see because of that. What are you? I think that says Sacred Coil. I'm not 100% sure. Hmm. I do not know how to get rid of that. Um. Right. Progeny. A loose network of human psionics. Their vision for City 31's future is in entirely psionic whether the city wants it or not uh, Grey Phoenix an organization of alien scavengers uh, they have quietly amassed the kind of referee reclamation is mandated to recover okay. or sacred coil it's either sacred coil or sacred soil well, I say so considering by this one uh, an underground religious movement of hybrids they preach salvation but only to those who once fought XCOM I'm gonna go I'm gonna go this one sacred soil sacred coil is what coil. happens when former advent officers find religion or create one they claim to be the true path for City 31's hybrids, as long as that path involves armed sedition. Director, these are local criminals. Isn't that 31 PD's jurisdiction? True. The Reclamation Agency supports local police, but we're also required to recover dangerous material. From those who would do the world harm, and each of those groups is neck deep in the stuff. So what next? Focus on a single group. Investigate, dismantle their operations, and take them down. Meanwhile, we look for any links to the mayor's death. Either way, a dangerous organization is off the streets. Exactly. The city wants justice for Mayor Nightingale. This is how we help them achieve it. Okay. Tackling investigations. Every investigation has three stages. Groundwork from the... Sorry. Groundwork, operations, takedown. Groundwork. From the 
from this first mission, learn about the faction and their methods. Operations. Hidden missions that must be relieved then revealed then completed to knock out the faction's main plans. Take down, stop their final attack and end their threat to City 31. Boom. Okay. Some progress. Dark events. Okay. Faction leader, second march, investigation opened. Okay. So Active investigation. Investigate Sacred Coil. We need to know more about Sacred Coil before uh, we can proceed with our investigation. A faction overview. An underground religious movement for hybrids. They preach salvation, but only to those who once fought XCOM. Okay. No active dark events. Investigation log. Second of March. Investigation open. A faction leadership. Sacred Coil's propaganda is directly adapted from Advent. Their leadership must have a connection. Okay. So how do we continue? Right, visit the assembly area. Check it out. Headquarters sent us an assembly. The right patterns, we can build anything. Or we could with the latest version. What you're looking at is the extremely finicky 2038 model. It'll take time to stress test our patterns, but once we have them, we're good to go. Uh, assembly. Assembly projects are how to how you get access to new and better items and equipment. Each project can unlock new items for XCOM supply, new weapon or armor upgrades. Or a variety of use of other useful things. Agents assigned here de decrease the time it takes to complete a project. Wonderful. Elorium resources. Elorium is one of the mo uh, one of the three resources reclamation requires. It is spent to complete projects in the assembly. Mm. I have no active project. Android personnel. Ooh. I don't listen to it. I assume this is the only one because I'm like, ooh. Yeah. I believe that's going to take two days. Can I fit someone in? I don't know if I want to. Why did he back? But it's going to take two days, that's fine. Okay. Highland Square. Investigate Sacred Coil. Credits resources. Credits are one of the three resources reclamation requires. They are spent to supply to both buy new items and upgrade existing ones. So reward is 35 credits. Okay. So we have two of them. It's Elorium and Credits. So we will learn a third one soon. Difficulty easy. Investigate sacred coil. Whisper here. I'll keep you updated on any activities requiring our attention. Speaking of which, sacred coil is raiding a storage facility that holds Advent Era contraband. We should prevent that, right? Uh, yep. Highly. Uh, send APC. Agent recruit pending. A new agent is available to recruit. Please visit the armory to make your selection for responding to the target. Okay. That's not quite good to the armory. No, it's assembly. Blech. Back out. Armory. Sweet. The armory. The armory is where you manage the agent. Manage your agent. Load out agent abilities, agent biography. Tint armor. Cool. Manage weapons, armor, and other items. Unlock new abilities by promoting agents that have earned enough XP. Learn more about the agent's background in their, in their biography. And tint the armor, change the color of your agent's uniform. Select an agent icon to begin management. The director convinced the city council we're too understaffed to be effective. 
This means we can bring more agents to City 31. It's not the whole squad, not yet, but it's something. Ooh. Axiom. Roll high damage, cover destruct, cover destruction. Surrender or don't. I'm fine with either. Are you? Nine health, mobility, smash, rage, and currently batting ram, which is locked. Looks like a muton. Zephyr, close quarters, high mobility, crippling bow, fearless. And then we have Claymore, explosive, AOE, breaching. We're going to go Claymore. At the moment. Whisper, where is the mess? Claymore. All around you, pal. <laughs> Very funny. I brought a fish curry for the squad. How do you sneak that past headquarters? Three spare canteens. You are the man. I'm the man who serves dinner in 15 minutes. Agent biography. I'm not going to read all this out. Uh, I'm just going to leave this up here for a couple of seconds. So if you guys want to pause, you can do and read through this. I'm going to do it on all of them individually. I do like the design in which some of these guys have done this. Um, these guys are look, uh, looking interesting. The artwork and the design of the game. Uh, I can honestly say it only gets better with each game. Right. Agent's Idol. Bad one. There we go. We are not the police. If you see a theft, call it into 31 PD and move on. But there is one notable exception. Hostile forces carrying dangerous contraband may attempt to flee the scene. Don't let them escape. You got breach charge, okay. No one else got stuff, okay. Our temporary field office has all the basics. Weapons, comms, and ammunition. Supply is where we request everything else. As long as it's in the squad's budget, it's ours. Alright, XCOM supply. The XCOM supply is where you buy all your core items and equipment. Items can items you unlock from assembly projects become permanently available here too. You can get a sweet deal on combat grade androids. I know. Everyone hates him. Flashbang. Be helpful. Ceasefire grenade. Breaching charge. Auto card key. Grants breach access through a security door. Auto card uses a brute force attack to push through a security door. Med kit. Smoke grenades. I'll tell you what. We're getting a flash flashbang. And smoke grenade. We don't have a snipe yet, so we don't need tracer rounds. We'll have ceasefire as well. Right then. So, utility item. We will go. Flashbang. Utility item you can have smoke grenade and in our little next person we will have ceasefire grenade. Right, we are kitted out. So here we go. That was my face. 
this week, a security camera spotted sacred coral flunkies sniffing around this warehouse. Today, the silent alarm went off. The place is full of Advent-era contraband on the way to a tech vault. Some things are best left in the past. Oh, come on, bitch. Right, breach mode. Watchtower. What's a massive thing? Activate Overwatch after breach. Terror from Godmother. Bitch. Last unit, right, for delayed snare, last unit for you, this door will be routed for one round. Unfortunate. Right. Okay, guys. Uh, just before we do this, anyone that's going to comment saying, oh, no, I would have done this differently, I will 100% appreciate any advice on how to do things better going forward um, also remember everyone has different play styles so constructive criticism 100% accept anyone that's just gonna be rude and mean and just saying blah, 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 blah. guys remember everyone plays differently my strategies are different to yours we may get the same result then again we may not but in the meantime Let's get ready to breach. Stay behind me. It's go time. Oh, Mac. Surprise. Surprise. I did not want that. You. I'm hitting you. Got it. No. You. Oh, team up. Once per mission, an agent can be moved on the timeline, so they can take turn. They can take the next turn, so that they take the next turn. This ability is shared by the entire squad. Ooh. Preparation. Preparation grants a defensive bonus and moves the agent's next turn earlier in the timeline. Use this when an agent is caught in a dangerous situation or to coordinate tactics. Okay. Rooted. Okay. Units that are rooted or blocked from moving from their current position. So. Terminal's rooted at the moment. Team up. Might need time what I can do and I'm on Jared Load. Sacred Coil stole specialized mech parts, the kind you can't easily replicate. Mech? Weapons free. 
sacred coil does not escape with those parts. It's gonna be part of breach mode. Right, pinpoint successful shots on enemy enemies will crit. First unit through this again is plus one armor, and then next one's Overwatch. Right, pinpoint. We're going terminal. Keep up door. Verge. These two will be called Mother and Cho. They get Overwatch. Open sesame. That one's alert. Right, so ocean cartridges will result in um, unrest increase in the city district. Move adjacent to civilians to immediately remove them from play. Uh, and rescue them. Okay, so alright, civilians here. How that work? Throwing grenades. Crossing over. Good form. He has no cover now. Sacred coil is on the run. Don't lose them in the warehouse. Don't plan on. Alright. So delayed snare means they'll be rooted. This also might be going to overwatch. Running start. Units can use run and gun ability. You would have the one gun ability to do. Right, we are going. Cherub. Terminal. And Verge. All going through there when not having the Right. Here we go. Reaching in. Reaching. <laughs> No 
aggressive, you're alert. Clear the contraband storage warehouse, prevent the second core from escaping. Okay. Right then. Well, we need to get rid of you. Up here. It's a pacifier. It's a cherry gun first, isn't it? Who am I next? Terminal, okay. This is a new feature of Overwatch. Okay, I haven't got Overwatch in that direction. Sweet. Alright, pacifies next. Put you in a stupor, mate. Stunned. Can't subdue. Mm -hmm. can On the way. Almost. Almost a flawless. If I'd have checked more, I might have had it. But nonetheless. Mech heist. Uh, curtain tail. Operation Venom Curse. Good work. Blessing City 1. City 31 needs is more. Adamant mechs. Spreading terror. Oh, and Director Kelly's on the line. I'll patch her through when you get back to base. Lovely. One capture, 20% chance of earning 20 intel. Wonderful. Civilians rescued, two enemies captured, one, taken killed. Took three rounds. Sweet. Rewards 35 credits. Okay, from the archives, Bradford aliens in your agency. Jane, what are you thinking? Kelly, what is our greatest essential? Greatest personal threat. Bradford, the old is returning. Kelly, if they do. Who will, who will we need to fight them off? Bradford, everyone, I get it. I've seen the projections, but do you really think the commander will go for this? Kelly. 
I think the commander has always seen the bigger picture. Transcript of a reclamation working group meeting. 2037, August 25. So this is three years after that. Which, if you look at the timeline at XCOM 2, this is five years after that as well. If Sacred Coil went after mechs, they need soldiers. But for what army? They were underground until Mayor Nightingale's election drove them to the surface. Their hatred for her gave them motive. Find out if Sacred Coil had the means to carry out an assassination. Okay, Sacred Coil in progress. Second of March. Spec Ops area. I'm authorizing Chimera Squad for special operations. Some ops provide useful resources for the squad. Keep an eye out for these opportunities. Ooh. Spec Ops are solo agent duties that help Chimera Squad and City 31 overall. They can improve unrest, gain resources, or reward temporary advantages on missions. So, bad handing, convince well to do individuals and businesses, business groups to provide stopgap funding in this time of crisis. We get, takes three days by the look of it, but we will get big by the credits. Legwork. Legwork. Um, bed with 31 PD for a short time in return, gain officers to. Canvas neighborhoods on our behalf. Takes three days, but you know. Set up false buys to draw out uh, underground Illyrium traffickers. We get some more Illyrium. Takes three days. You know what? Intel sounds a great this moment in time. Select a unit. Will you stop doing that? See, I think someone like Verge would be great for that. Assessment. Ooh! Android personnel grants one Android tactical unit. Purchase and stuff. Sweet! Modular Android. Modular armor. Modular weapons. I'll take one day. Cost us some Larian. We will do that. Right then, mission types. There are a variety of kind. There is a variety of a variety of kinds of mission targets. Okay, some of the English in this. Right, the mission types are investigations, side and emergency. Sorry about that. Uh, investigations. These appear purple, whether a uh, groundwork operation or takedown, and will advance the game story. So, so purple missions are story missions. Got that. 
outside these appear yellow they are optional but provide valuable re reward emergency these appear red showing up in districts with unrest problems cool 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 that sounds brilliant so main side uh, kind of main you need to get these done otherwise you have unrest and we don't want unrest reclamation links sacred coil to a variety of city 31's missing persons all human stop these human abductions and recover them from sacred coil time is of the essence This district is a target of an actual hostage operation, but we do not have enough to shut it down. Unrest will call will increase in the district while the operation is active. Completing lead missions will will accelerate your hour of investigation, giving us earlier opportunities to shut this down. Okay, five days. Right, so we can't do that for five days, basically. But we can shut down from company. Plus two days towards Operation Reveal. Gives us 55, so we can send in the squad for that. Chimera Squad, I'm Commissioner Maloof of 31 PD. To be blunt, I don't give a chrysalis ass about the politics. I'm glad you're in the city. 31 PD was stretched thin before the mayor's death. There are gaps to fill, and that's where you come in. When your agents can handle a situation better than my officers, I'll send the details your way. If the city council has a problem with that, I'll take the heat. They can't afford to fire me. I look forward to working with you. Sound good. Moderate uh, 31 PD pick up chatter on hostiles on route. That's good. Right, cutting edge. Now let's go up on Mars. 31 PD, a tip about a um, Lorian powered device used in a string of recent burglaries. We should seize it before it slips away. Sounds great. Right. So we now have four missions to crack on with. Here, that's already been worked on. Supply. New Android. We do not have the credits for it yet, though. Armory. Load out. You still have the flashbang. You still have smoke grenade. You have breaching charge. And you have a ceasefire grenade. Sweet. Oh, we do have a mech. You have constructed an android unit. These versatile soldiers are valuable back backups to your main squads. On any mission uh, where you are. Uh, mission where one of your agents is evacuated and an android can take their place for the remaining encounters. Assault rifle, body armor, we don't have breach, we don't have that, oh, it's okay. So, yeah. mm, sounds good. By investigation, new android. Ding. Yeah, I've viewed him. Gay charms. Yeah, that's my investigation tip. Spec ops. Now, what I could do? Legwork. Flex unit. Can't put him in. Please. Okay. Stop doing that. I want to back out of school. Okay. Well, before we crack on with one of these four, it's probably going to be one of these side ones, I think. Yeah, it's going to be one of these side ones. Um, again, I hope you guys have enjoyed the episode. If you have, hit like 
um, share and subscribe and also comment down below on anything you think could have done better in that mission um, and I'll catch you guys in the next one take care and also hope everyone has been enjoying XCOM Chimera Squad I have I'm going to continue to do this and the plan is to play this until we've finished um, win, lose or fail basically it's going to be win be positive guys it's going to be win we're going to do this so without further ado catch you guys in the next one take care